we actually got one dress uh, that she liked and we bought that one um i will show you guys the dress when we get home hey guys welcome to my channel we are going to stratford westfield and i'm taking you guys with me if you're new here my name is cynthia hello welcome to the channel we're in stratford you all so my adult daughter's birthday is fast approaching and we are at stratford westfield shopping for a birthday dress i am also shopping for a, a dress for myself um the first store that we went to was zara and as you guys can see my daughter was not interested in buying anything in zara okay this is the outfit for the day she had already made up her mind that she wow. wants to go to house of cbs to pick up her birthday dress um um this was my first time uh shopping and also entering the store called house of cbs now i must say they've got lovely dresses in this store and in my opinion the dresses here they all look very feminine price wise they are quite pricey most of the dresses cost above a hundred pounds i mean the nice dresses cost above a hundred pounds there were a few costing around 75 pounds 65 pounds and things like that um personally i will wait until they've got a good sales before i buy uh, expensive dresses but because it is my daughter's birthday we were flexible to allow her uh buy her dress at the agonimal price um so here we are just looking at dresses choosing the one that we like so that we can um, try it out um she picked about four dresses and guys a few dresses here caught my interest and i picked about three or four dresses to uh, try on that is me just doing a proper outfit of the day for you guys i've got this um, orange top which i got from tiktok shop and the jeans is from zara um this is the first outfit which i loved so much but they didn't have my size in store okay this is the first one the boobs area is not not holding because I'm a mom who has breastfed four kids until the age of three years plus. I mean, I stopped at three years, plus. that's his health. But I do like here, I do love this dress, and that's because I think it gives me that feminine, classy look. But they didn't have my size in store. Um, I could order online, but I wasn't sure if the next size up will fit me and I don't like a hassle of exchanging items in store for another item when they do not fit. Now this is the second one. I do like it. But it's got a very long slit like so. It's not bad. Now the second dress is my favorite guys i love 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 this dress this dress is giving me um model look you know like that naomi campbell that kind of runway model look and um but guys they did not have my size in store but i am going to um gamble with this one and check online to see if i can get my size um this is the third dress again they did not have my size in store maybe it was a sign for me not to uh buy a dress for myself on that day mm -hmm. what do you guys think um that here i am checking to my daughter she's next door um she's trying out her dress and uh i have seen the dress that she has chosen but i didn't vlog that part because i want to do a dress reveal um at home to show you guys the dress that uh, she got for her Bad day. 
and guys moments like this basically uh shopping with my daughter i don't take them for granted because these kiddos sometimes they just want to do their own thing and they don't want to involve their parent but when she says mom can we go shopping guys i jump at the opportunity to spend time with her because most times they are busy doing their own thing with their friends and once when when they call us basically i i don't say no you know if i'm not working i don't say no i am out with her and moments like this i do not take for granted okay we are going to grab something to eat um we actually going to wagamaga we bought a dress for her um i will show you guys a dress when we get home if she gives me the okay to show you guys the dress all right now i haven't been to this shopping center in like years but uh it is so crowded extremely crowded but it is what it is it is a weekend anyway maybe that's why it is crowded we are going to get something to eat and I will speak to you guys later. So they gave us this, right? This is my first time trying Mrs. Xu. Uh, it is a Chinese uh, restaurant. Um, we are allowed to sit anywhere, but when these things vibrate, it means that our food is ready. So basically we just go up to down there to pick up the food. And then when we pick up our food, I'm guessing we can return this back. So we got this. Your data. But I, I think this is pretty though. But then it's up to you. No, I put one in the tail like that. No, not exactly, I know. Yeah, it might add, it might add some extension here. Yeah, maybe. Okay. Okay. Now it is vibrating, meaning our food is ready. Should I go and pick it up while you wait here? Now, price wise, it is affordable. These meal, this one, and this one, yes? I didn't take away, just anyhow, but it's not these one and the sides are coming up cost us 32 pound just take it two pound not bad okay yes Thank you. 
guys it is the next day and i forgot to end the vlog yesterday so i'm going to end the vlog today um but before i end the vlog i want to show you guys what we got from um the cookware shop and also i'll show you guys my daughter's uh dress the one she got from house of cb it is my first time in that shop um these youngsters these teenagers they kind of know how to go to all this expensive posh shop you know sometimes if not because of her i don't think i would have gone to that shop it's not my kind of shop sha but when i went in there i saw a few dresses which i liked and i will definitely go to that store again okay let me show you guys what i got before i end the vlog okay let me show you guys what i got before i end the vlog one second i went to this store called pro cook pro cook and the website is called pro cook the food of uk it is a store based at the stratford well yeah. It is a store based at the Stratford Westfield and it is my first time going into that store. Now, in this store, I bought a few items. I didn't really spend much because I only went to pick up a dress for my daughter's birthday. Um, but let me tell you guys what I got. I spent a total of about less than £20 there or less than £15. I spent £14.60 in that store. Let's put you guys a little bit here now the first item <laughs> the first item i got was this pan brush now this is a brush used to scrub out all those burnt stubborn food now this costs only three pound i also got these honey dippers this one costs only two pound and i got four and that's because i sometimes struggle to find things in our house so at least i know that i won't struggle to find all four at the same time so that's how it looks like and my daughter wanted this spray bottle so i got her this this cost three pound in total i spent 14 pounds 60 in that store and i think i think i'm trying to work on my spending habits what do you guys do and um let me show you guys the birthday dress now we went to house of cbs let's take this off <laughs> guys i don't like wearing wig but at the moment my hair is all corn rolled back i'm trying to let it rest for a little while before i put it in a protective hairstyle um wig is not really my thing to be honest i don't like wearing wigs I, I don't like it i used to in the past before i was a wig queen but i feel i've overgrown that i prefer braiding my hair than wearing wigs but hey Let's manage it for now, you know. Anyway, we went to House of CBs. It was my first time going there, and it was my daughter's first time going there also. Um, we got her birthday dress here. One thing I have to say about this store is that I just love the way they present the packaging. Um, it is a small store, but the customer service there, I will say, is top notch, you know. Um, what else? I saw a few dresses there which I like for myself. I will get that for my birthday in July. Anyway, let's show you guys. I know you guys are eager to see the dress. Let me show you guys the dress. All right. Okay. The dress is wrapped in this lovely packaging, as you guys can see. House of CBs. And then I'm just gonna open it up for you guys to see how it looks like. It's also packaged there again. But tell you what, she hasn't opened it. So I'm not going to open it in this video. I will wait for her to um to uh, open it up first, and then I will show you guys the dress she got for her birthday. Um, what else? What else? What else? I just want to thank you guys so much for the support you guys have given to me on this channel. To my new subscribers, I love you guys. I see you guys. I love you guys. Thank you so much for joining the family. What else? What else? Um, next month I will upload mainly silent vlog. Just trying new things on my channel, being creative, things like that. Um, let's see how it goes. Um, what else? I think I'll end the vlog here. But before that, let me do a bit of uh, how you call it? How you call that thing? <laughs> how you call that thing? Uh, thumbs nail. Yeah. Okay. 
yeah anyway let's end the vlog here until next time keep striving to better yourself than you were previously and all you need is the baby steps i will see you guys in the next vlog bye guys